Hello. In this session, we will try to understand the algebraic expression a minus b whole squared. We will use a square to understand the expression a minus b whole squared. We know that all the sides of a square are the same. Let us imagine that the side of this square is a. In that case, the area of this will be a squared. But we are trying to understand a minus b whole squared. So what I am trying to do is, I will divide this side into two parts. And I will call this as b. Similarly, I will divide this side also into two parts. And I will call this B. So from here to here it will be A minus B. So from here to here it will be A minus B. I will draw these lines so that it will be easy for you to see. Okay, so now let us look at this square. From here to here it is a minus b. So from here to here this is also a minus b. Okay, and from here to here it is b. This side is done and this side is done. Let us look at this side now. So from here to here this is b. In that case from here to here it is a minus b. This side is done, this side is done, this side is, this is done. So now let us <coughs> look at this square. To find out the area of this square which is a minus b into a minus b is a minus b whole squared. So this is the area that we will have to find out. To find out this area, we will have to remove or we will have to take away this shaded part from, we already said that the side of this big square is A, right? So we will have to remove the shaded part from A squared. So let us do that. I will use a cutter to remove this rectangle. I will remove even this part. Right? So we have two rectangles. Now let us see what the area of this rectangle is and what the area of this rectangle is. So the area of this rectangle is B into A which is AB. So can we write down what we have just done? We will write down what we have done. So we are supposed to find the area of this square. So to find out the area of this square a minus b whole squared what we will do is we will have to remove these two from the whole big square which is a squared minus this rectangle and this rectangle. So what is this rectangle? This is a isn't it? From here to here it is a. So a into b minus 
a b and now we have to remove this part also so which is minus b into a minus b so let us write minus b into a minus b okay now let us simplify this a squared minus a b minus b into a is minus a b minus into minus is plus b into b is b squared okay so now let us write this a squared and we have two of these what a b is minus a minus a b minus a b so minus 2 a b and plus b squared we can also write it in order which is a squared plus b squared minus 2 a b the other way of looking at this is to find out the area of this square which is a minus b whole squared is to remove this piece this piece and this piece from a squared now let us look at the area of each of these pieces so the area of this rectangle is b into a minus b okay fine and now let us look at the area of the square so b into b is b squared let us look at the area of this b into a minus b is b into a minus b now let us write down what we discussed a minus b whole squared is equal to a minus b whole squared is equal to a squared minus this rectangle b into a minus b so minus b into a minus b for us to understand better let us put this bracket minus this rectangle so the area of this is also b into a minus b put a bracket around this minus the square which is minus b squared now let us remove the brackets a squared minus b into a is a b b into b is b squared but minus b so this will be minus b squared minus b into a is a b b into minus b is minus b squared minus b squared now let us remove these brackets a squared minus a b minus into minus is plus b squared minus a b minus into minus is plus b squared minus b squared now this plus b squared and minus b squared get cancelled so we get a squared minus a b and another minus a b so we have two minus a b's so we'll write it as minus two a b plus b squared we can even write this as a squared plus b squared minus 2 a b so this is the area of this square which is a minus b whole squared